Hi everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how to add a free shipping progress bar to WooCommerce using a plugin called Merchant Pro. So Merchant Pro is an all-in-one WooCommerce plugin that offers over 40 modules designed to boost the sales on your store. So I'm going to go over now to a test site where I already have Merchant Pro installed and I've enabled the free shipping bar module. So the first thing you have to do, if you haven't done it already, is add a shipping zone for the area where you want to offer free shipping. So you just click on add zone and I'm just going to give it a name, I'm just going to call it free. And then you choose the region where you want to offer free shipping. So just for the purposes of the demo, I'm going to select all countries and add shipping method. Here you want to choose free shipping, continue, and then you want to set a minimum order amount. So I'm going to choose £100. You can, of course, choose whatever you like. And by ticking this, you can say that this will apply before any coupons or not. So I'm going to create the zone. So now I have my free shipping zone. So now I can go back to the options page for the free shipping bar module. So this, these are the default settings. So let's go over to our store and have a look. So first of all, I'm going to turn on the top bottom bar and click save. And I'm just going to refresh. So here we have now you can see at the bottom here, we have this bar and there's a little bit too much space at the bottom. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my settings. And I'm just going to reduce the text bottom spacing to zero pixels and refresh. Okay, so now the bar looks good. So it says free shipping for orders over hundred pounds. That is the default text for when customers haven't added anything to their cart yet. So let's see what happens when I add something. Let's say I add this Beanie with logo for 20 pounds. Okay, so now you can see straight away I'm just going to focus on this bar. It says you are 80 pounds away from free shipping. So it automatically updates as soon as the customer adds any item to their cart. And it will disappear when the customer scrolls down and it will appear again when they scroll up. They can also dismiss it just by hitting the X button there. So I'm just going to disable the top bottom bar for now and focus on the other locations we can have the bar. So let's go through and have a look. So we have, so here we have the progress bar turned on. I'm actually going to start off by turning off the progress bar for each location so we can see how it looks without that. And then I'll turn on again later on in the demo. So let me refresh. So you can see here, we have a similar message. You are 80 pounds away from free shipping. And then as soon as we click add to cart, that will update. So it says now you are 60 pounds away from free shipping. This is the side cart, which is another module we have in Merchant and I have it enabled and it works together with the free shipping bar module. So we have here the message, you're 60 pounds away from free shipping. Let's close this. And then this is the mini cart, same message there. And then if we go to the actual cart page, we will see another bar. And if we proceed to the checkout, we will see another bar. So you can choose exactly which ones you want to have on, which ones you might not want to have on. And the idea of course is that customers will see how far away they are from free shipping and they will be motivated to try and reach that goal, get free shipping and add more items to their cart and that will increase your average order value. So now let's turn on the progress bar for each location and then we will have another look. Let me save. Let's go back to the shop. Let's go to a product. So now we can see we have this progress bar as well as the message. And it, we notice it looks a little bit cramped. So what we can do is similar to what we did at the start of the tutorial, we can just add 15 pixels of text bottom spacing 
hit refresh and now it looks good the elements in the bar are nicely spaced out so if we add cart you will notice that the bar fills up and it just gives the customer a visual representation of how far away they are from free shipping it also draws a bit more attention to the bar if you like that so we can see it will show everywhere it will show you can choose but I've turned it on for every location. So you can see it in the mini cart. You will see it in the side cart here. And it will also show on the cart page, which I can get to by clicking here. And it will be the same on the checkout. So that is it. That is how to add a free shipping progress bar to WooCommerce using Merchant Pro. If you have any questions about this functionality, please leave your comment down below. Thanks so much for watching.